All right, so this is ToolsNet 8. Um, you have your dashboard, you can look at different tools, you can customize this to how, what you want it to look at from traces to latest results, uh, not okay tightenings. Um, but I'm gonna go ahead and dive into the reports because uh, that's what we've been talking about. And in your reports, um, we'll run one here and scroll down to where I was for your tightenings. And it was these four, M4. And if you click on this to expand it, you can see different flavors of trace, torque and angle, torque over time, etc. Um, in the details tab, you kind of see everything that is happening in the controller. A lot of this information is um, not really useful, but uh, it is there and it is putting all that into ToolsNet 8. And then uh, what, we, what I want to show you is steps. And so what we saw in Tools, Tech two, tools Talk 2 uh, was steps 1, 2, and 3, tighten the angle, tighten the torque, tighten the torque, and everything that occurred in those. So I'm going to expand these out as well. And you can see the results for each of them. Again, we went to 180 degrees in the first step. The second step, we went to... <coughs> Six newton meters uh, went to 6.11 in this case, and uh, the prevailing torque is right here, 2.02. It's kind of hard to see zoomed in, so if I was to zoom out, it um, says step monitor resolve prevailing torque 2.02. .02. And if you were to export this into an Excel file, it would clearly show it as well. And then in step three, uh, the overall peak torque at 10.19 newton meters. And that's that.